Welcome back, lovelies, today's video. I've been telling you, as you saw from the title, that I need to put, I will show you in a minute, everything that I need to put away. Really quick, do not mind the crazy hair. Look how long it's already getting on the sides. Like, okay, I mean, it's still really short here, but definitely way longer, way longer than it was. And the other thing, I'm in my crusty night outfit. It is 4 a.m. I have not been to bed. You see my Resident Evil screen saver over there for any gamers might know. But I've been up playing my game all night. It's 4 a.m. And I decided that I want to put everything away. Sorry, I'm eating a lifesaver. But you're going to come on the journey with me. These are the nails we're rocking now. Love them. But you're going to come on the journey with me. I'm going to turn the camera around. I'm going to show you everything we got to put away. And sorry at the beginning I was all over the place. I'm not used to holding my camera. But we're going to turn the camera around. I'm going to show you everything. And we're going to get to putting it away. If you enjoy that, please consider subscribing down below. And leave me a like to let me know that you enjoyed. And like I always say, leave me a comment. Tell me what you were doing it for you. And were you asleep like most normal people? Because I sure wasn't. But let's go. Okay. So we have this big box. We have this big box full of stuff. We have all of that stuff and we gotta find a place for all that. But I'm figuring all of that, that's my disinfectant, is gonna go in here after we take everything out. Also, I got this for Christmas. It was peppermint candies from the dollar store. I ate them all, but it's so big. Like here, hold on. Here's my hand. Like, it's big, so I'm thinking, well, if I can hold it, thinking instead of having those three different things holding my brushes, take them all and put them all in here. So we're also gonna do that. So with all of that, let's get into the video. I'm gonna turn you around and we're gonna get started. Okay, I hope this is a good angle. I'm trying to get used to having this big iPod stand and you guys being able to see. Now I'm gonna spray this with disinfectant and wipe it down. These are very heavy. So, I'm not going to move those at the moment. But I'm thinking about taking everything down out of them and wiping those down as well. We have a Biore Charcoal Cleansing Micellar Water. It's a smaller one for, like, travel. And then if you guys follow me on Instagram, which you should. This is my Instagram name. I just repurchased my favorite. Out of all the eye creams, and you guys know I use a lot of them. This is my favorite. This is the Glow and Get It. Tula Skincare Balanced. It's their balanced skincare line. This is the Glowing Get It Eye Balm. Freaking love this. It is $28, by the way. But Alta just had it on sale for $14. So I grabbed one. I wish I'd have grabbed more now. Let me show you how much you get. Why does mine look like that? What the hell? It's like a damn like that legit fits my finger perfectly like it's a fingerprint what the hell but i don't think it is because there's nothing on the other side but anyways it has like a silicone -y. this is how much you get it has like a silicone -y feel to it so i'm sure it has some kind of silicone in it i could be wrong but it's so nice let me show you like it just glides on like butter and oh it just feels so nice you guys so I had to get another one. The first time I got this was in BoxyCharm. We're not going to talk about each item this extensively because this video would be a million years long. But the first time I got this was in BoxyCharm and I fell in love. I use these for pictures. Like, how cute is this? And it's a freaking eraser, but of course I don't erase with it. When I clean things like this that aren't super dirty, I just use disinfectant spray. I had to clean this because last time I was filming when I was doing the uh, Christmas wrapping with me, I spilled apple juice under that one. I cleaned it up, but I figured it still needed a good cleaning. Before we put everything away, let's take everything out of these, get them more organized so that when we have the other stuff, it'll be easier for me to know where it goes. Let's get you guys a little closer. Let's get started. 
I'll show you what each thing is, but that's about it. This is the Radial Soft Focus Glow Drops, Illuminating Glow Drops. We have a Bodyography Pro Makeup Cleaner. Let me know if you guys would like to see me clean all my brushes. I have a lot. This is the Elemis Superfood Glow Priming Moisturizer. Put that over there. This is a ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Acid Setting Spray. Put the cleaner there. Setting sprays. I'm trying to, you know, put them in piles. This is the Ulta Beauty 50 Sun Protection Broad Spectrum SPF 50 Sunscreen Rose Water Setting Spray. That was a mouthful. I got this. It is a Meg Rhythm Gentle Steam Eye Mask. I've yet to use it, but you can see it's an actual eye mask. And it says, um, keep eyes closed. Do not press the mask against your eyes during application. It pretty much, you put it on and it like, it, it steams up. I'll put that over there. We got the Wet n Wild Twinkle Star Glow Face Mist. We got the Makeup Obsession Moon Glow Illuminating Setting Spray. Let me shake it up and show you. Do you guys see that? Pretty. We have Revolution Brush Cleaner. I shouldn't have those on my setting sprays. We have a All-in-One Brightening Vitamin C Micellar Water. We have a Water Rose All-in-One Hydrating Micellar Water. And one of my favorites is by Collab. I literally just finished one of these. The Micellar Cleansing Water. Like, it has a, a kind of a, not really a sweet smell, but a, definitely a smell. Okay, so we got all that. Um, I kind of want to try and get it all out before I decide where to put everything. I've yet to use this. This is the Keys Be Luminous Exfoliating. It's like a powder exfoliator. And then we got the Keys Skin Transformation Cream. I got both of these in Influencer. This is definitely not paid for by Influencer, but if you have not or don't know who they are, download the app. All you do is go on there. Anything you have, food, houseware, clothing, skincare, makeup, bathing products, cleaning products, I mean anything, stuff for your, your car, electronics, anything you buy. Look it up on there, review it. After so many reviews, they'll start sending you emails that you fill out the little survey and they'll send you free products to review. I've gotten so many free products, it's crazy. Okay, let's see. These are like illuminators. Here's skincare. We have the Too Faced Hangover Good to Go SPF 25 moisturizer. We got the coconut face milk from 4th Ray. We have the papaya face milk from 4th Ray. We got the Vino Rejuvenating Boost Serum. And the Turmeric Brightening Serum from 4th Ray. Let's see, we got serums and face milk. This is my backup from e.l.f., the brightening pads. Um, that'll just go here. I love these from Revolution Beauty because they're spray-on. They got all different kinds. This one's the Glycolic Acid Revitalizing Essence Spray. And you guys saw the one in my skincare update video, if you've seen it, that I have one of these spray ones. It's purple, and it's a rejuvenating superfood one. Love it. We got the 4th Ray Rainfall 2.5% Hyaluronic Acid Serum. This is also good for blue light, like if you're on a lot of electronics, which I am. We have the 4th Ray Papaya Face Milk and the 4th Ray Chamomile Face Milk. You can see this is the full size. This is the mini. But even at that, look... These are both full, oh, sorry, these are both full size. This one's thicker, but this one's taller. Let me see. This is 0.9 fluid ounces. This is one fluid ounce. So this has 0.5 fluid ounce less, and I don't know why. Okay. We have the Trilogy Overnight Mask 
Oh, I think this is a face mask. I need to put this in my face mask drawer. I thought it was like a rub on overnight mask. I love this. This is, oh, it's sticky is what it is. But this is the e.l.f. Super Tone Bright, a toner with brightening fruit acids. From when I spilled that damn apple juice. This is from e.l.f. I love this toner. Put toner right there. Then we have, I freaking love this. This is the e.l.f. Super Hydrate, a moisturizer with hydrating squalane. I showed it to you guys before, but real quick. Like, look at it. It's like jelly. I love it. So I have that. So this is a moisturizer. This needs to go over there. Did you guys hear that sticking? That's why I got to clean this. This is... Oh, this is the Drench and Quench Cream to Water Hydrator for all skin day... For, for all day moisture... Felt like it was leaking. No, definitely wasn't, but that's what it looks like. Maybe it was just the wetness of the cloth. Let me get all that off. And a little bit goes a long way. Another moisturizer. And then we got this. This is the Elf Skin Hydro Gel Moisturizer, which I've yet to try. Right now, I'm using the other water gel in the red. This was their new line. This and the sleeping face mask and something else. I think it was a cleanser. We have the Trilogy Vitamin C Moisturizing Lotion. Okay, maybe we need to move everything over because we got a lot of moisturizers. We have a small pharmacy honey moon glow AHA resurfacing night serum. I'm pretty sure I got this in Ipsy. And then I have this, which I've yet to try. Whoops. Then I have this, which I've yet to try. This is Regeni, R-E-G-E-E-N-I. The Retinol Advanced Cream, which is moisturizing, anti-aging, and firming with 3% retinol, vitamin E, C, and B5, and hyaluronic acid. I got this free. Um, this brand messaged me on Instagram and asked me if I'd like to try it. They cash up to me the money and then I went on Amazon, immediately bought it. All I got to do is try it and leave a review. I was like, okay. Okay. So these are primers. We have the Baby Skin Pore Eraser Primer. We have the NYX Marshmallow Primer, which I love this. If you've never tried it, give it a try. It definitely fills in the pores and makes your skin so soft. But always read the ingredients in case there's something you might be allergic to. Then we have the nourishing. Oh, this is a body scrub. We got the Theory Body Body Scrub. Put that up there. Why that was with the primers. We have an Essence Prime Plus Studio Hydrating Plus Skin Refreshing Primer, which I get to try. This is one I love, if you could tell by how little's left. This is the Rose Plus Primer Serum. The Photo Focus line from Wet n Wild. We have this little mini baby Lancome Ultra Wear Sunscreen. Um, it says it's transfer resistant. Looks like that. Does it have color to it? It does. Look how dark that is. Oh my lord, there's no way I could use that. Well, maybe, because look when you blend it out. I mean, you could tell it's a lot darker. I do. We're going to declutter that because there's no way I could use that. And I don't really want to put it in a giveaway because I don't like putting face complexion other than like bronzer and highlight. Other than that, I don't like putting colored face products. This is In Love With Cocoa Wet n Wild Face Primer. I don't know why this is down there. This is a fourth rate coconut body milk. 
we have another wait did we have a benefit no wait no we had a Too Faced this is a benefit professional hydrating primer and then we have an elf puff puff primer it has hemp derived cannabis sativa in it Then we have the Rerum Natural Body Cream. So that should not be up there. I think at the time I was just putting things wherever I could fit them. Then we have, look at this packaging though. You guys can't see the sparkles inside there. That sucks. But this is the Juno & Co. Moonshine Miracle Cream. Yet to use it because I just don't want to use it and run out. But I'm going to. This shows you how much I love this. Here's a second of this. And then we have the e.l.f. Holy Hydration Face Cream. Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Sunscreen in it. Which this is like a staple for anybody that loves e.l.f. Sunscreen. Now, let's clean this out. Okay, that one is clean. So, we're going to try and get the tall things in first to make sure they fit before we do the other things. So, this is definitely going to go in this area. Can you guys see? I'll definitely zoom it in to make it a little easier. I also want to show you guys my new diaries. I love horror things. So, for anybody that knows, this is Jason. Friday the 13th. This is what the pages look like. And the back is just black. And has like a soft matte feel. Now, this one, I'm kind of upset about. It's real leather. I thought it would be fake. $20 for this and it's real leather. I'm like, there's no way it's real. But, I mean, it could be fake. But it seems like it's real leather. It's got this on the back of it. It's pretty thick. It has this that you tie around it. <clears throat> and you just tuck it up under for it to be tied. And then inside the paper is not lined. And the paper itself is very thick. And it feels like paper you used to make back in school. So, I don't know if it's actually real. I keep telling myself it's not. Oh, let me show you the details. It was the Day of the Dead one that I picked with these nice details. There's the back. Because as I told you before, how I am with diaries. Like, all those are filled diaries. But I don't agree with buying things made out of real leather. So, I don't know if it really is. But I really hope it's not. So that is a toner. That will not fit. So that's probably why I had that up, up there. So down here, the cellar water. There we go. Those fit perfectly. Now what else do we have that's tall? This. Okay, it fits there. That is a moisturizer. So I'd like to keep all the moisturizers together, or at least all the e.l.f. products together. Keep those both there. Dang it. I am just having trouble, y'all. Okay. Now I got all my e.l.f. things, all of them. Can this fit like... No! No! That was a catastrophe, but we fixed it. Okay. That fits, and I'm just like that. 
not going to try and stick anything else in there because that's how it happened last time. It's the catastrophe. My setting sprays have to go up top. There's no other way. So we're going to put them up here. And I have more setting sprays, so I'm going to move them over here when I get, you know, the time. Now, primers. They're not very tall, so they could all go somewhere fairly, you know, short in height. Which, that's not, that's too short. And that's too short. Damn. That's tall enough, but I'm going to keep them down there. This is a setting spray. Put all the primers in. I'll try and put the tallest ones in the back. Are you freaking kidding me? They got to go up here, unfortunately. So I'm going to try and put the tallest ones in the back and keep the names front and center if I can. Okay, we got the Elf, the Professional. One definitely needs to go back. Now that I took out the ones that weren't primers, it definitely has more room. Taller than that. We got this, and then we got that. Okay, we got room for more primers. fit there so all the face milks and thing of things of that type will all go here try and keep the names front and center so when i'm looking because i plan on doing a shop my skincare stash with you guys okay we got coconut papaya this is a moisturizer let's put this in the back because it's biggest. There we go. That. Got that. No, I'm not gonna even try. Okay. See, here's my dilemma. Okay, this is a primer. This needs to go over there. This says it's a glow priming moisturizer. I would say it's a primer. Oh, I tried this as a moisturizer and it just, it wasn't it, sis. Okay. And then, what is this? This is a night serum. Um... These are serums as well. Let's go ahead and put in with those. This is an essence spray. We're going to pop that up top. Oh, no, no, no. Don't put that there. Those aren't serums. Those are moisturizers. These are the serums. Let me guess. You're too big. A freaking course you are. But I don't want to. Ha ah, down there. I don't want to use the super big ones if I don't have to. Down the front. This is those are also moisturizers. Oh wait, 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 wait. Are you kidding me? Okay, as much as I want these in the front because they're so light they keep falling. So we're just gonna put them all in here. And then we're going to stick these in front of them. Hopefully that'll keep them from falling out. There. Perfect. What in the hell is this? Okay, now back to this. This is a moisturizer. And a moisturizer. Oh, maybe I can. There we go. Sideways. It won't slide off. This is an exfoliator. So we got to find a spot for that sucks because I can't put the baby one with those. I guess I'll just put him up there. And then we got 
the brush cleaners. We'll just put them there for now, but they're definitely not going to stay there. And that's not going to stay there. Time to take this stuff off and clean this one. There are a lot on here. Okay, we got the Aceology Overnight Lip Mask. I need to have my own section for that stuff. Definitely. This is the Incredible Crystal Ball Roller Lip Gloss, which I won't lie. Or wait, is it a perfume? I can't remember. No, it's a lip gloss. I liked it. I liked the whole concept of the crystals, but yeah, this is time to uh, declutter. Okay, we got another micellar skin active all-in-one waterproof makeup remover. That's nice. As you can tell, I like Garnier skin active micellar water. We'll put that up there for now. Now we have, why is it all jacked up? We have the Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask. So masks are over here. We got the Terra Mars Number 8 Gel. I think that's in another language. This is a body cleanser. Body cleansers are going in the middle. We have a Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Hydro Set Refreshing Spray. So this is like a setting spray. Actually, we're going to keep all the setting sprays out because I knew I had more and I want to put them all together. We have the Chocolate Cherry. Oh my God, I got a bad mind. Do you see that? Uh, right there. I thought it said F-U-C-K-I-N-G in spray, not fixing spray. Why it ever would say that, who knows. We got the Wet n' Wild. Oh, wrong side. Mega Glow Face Mist from the Crystal Set. We got a Professional from Benefit Super Setter. I'll keep the little ones over here. We have a detox hair serum. So I'm going to set that over here with the body scrub. Oh, I forgot to put this in there. It goes in its own right down there. It has its own because it's that damn special. Okay, we'll put the mask on. We have another In Love with Cocoa Wet n Wild Setting Mist. I'm going to tell you now. If you've never tried Wet n Wild Setting Mists, you're missing out. They're cheap. And they're good. So. Ooh, we got a Laura Mercier, Laura Mercier Soothing Eye Makeup Remover. I do like me some good eye makeup removers. But the test is if my eyes burn with it. Because I'll tell you right now. The oil-free eye makeup remover from Neutrogena is the only one out of all the ones I've tried that my sensitive eyes do not burn. So if you got sensitive eyes and they burn and use eye makeup removers, try this. I promise you they won't. I had my daughter-in-law try it. She fell in love after that because her eyes didn't burn. We have two continuous setting mists from Morphe that are completely full. I do love those because if you've never tried them, such a fine mister. It doesn't really have a smell, just smells clean. I got this. Let's give this a try. It feels nice and creamy. Not sticky at all. Very pretty. Ooh. I'm not sure what it smells like, but it smells good. This was a Halloween one, so it was meant to look like a little vial of blood, but I like it. It feels good. Don't know why this stuff's over here because this stuff's about to get out of here. We got this. We have all of these lip liners along with some Jaclyn Hill lip glosses and her lip cream. So I'm going to just set these on the floor for now. We have, this is a perfume. Let's see what it smells like. 
smells pretty good, actually. Okay. I'll put that down there for now. We have the Certified Organic Rosehip Oil. Thank you, Julia. From Trilogy. Oh, it's a roller ball. I remember now why I didn't use it. Because the roller ball was stuck. Oh, I got it going. Oh, yeah. I'll definitely be using this now. I'm going to put this up above my bed. We have a pencil sharpener. pair of little snippers. So little snippers will go down there. Pencil sharpener I might leave there, but for now, we're just going to wait and see. Now, I do love this from Dr. Brandt. This is the antioxidant spray toner with green and white tree ex 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 extract. And like I said, I love spray toners and essence and things. Because you don't got to waste product on a pad. You just spray them. So, this is a toner. So, that needs to go over there. I do like this as well. But the sprayer. Let's see. Oh, not one. Sorry. Usually, it'll just have one single spray coming out. And every time I want to use it, I got to clean the sprayer. But this is Clean Skin Club Pineapple Glow Mist, Hyaluronic Acid, Peptides, and Antioxidant. And if you can see, it's right there because I switched it out when I switched up for a new routine. This I've yet to try. This is the Glow Oasis pH Balancing Moisture Milk Toner. So, definitely want to try that. One of my all-time favorite toners, the Pharmacy Deep Sweep 2% BHA Pure Cleaning toner. Love this. Expensive, but love it. A little mask over there. Okay. This is the Dr. Brandt Triple Antioxidant Eye Cream. You have to use it. Put that with the lip mask. We got a little e.l.f. Um, illuminating eye cream that I keep around for if I go anywhere. Another all-time favorite. This is the Cherry Up Brightening Vitamin C Eye Cream from Pharmacy. Pharmacy and Glow Recipe are two great brands. Two very expensive brands, but two great brands nonetheless. That's why I don't have a lot of their stuff, because I get it when I absolutely need it. This is another elf, a bigger eye cream. This is the Nourishing Night Cream. Oh, it's not an eye cream. And then this is another all-time favorite eye cream. This is the Water Drop Hydrating Eye Gel from 4th Ray. But it is amazing and takes the tiniest amount. Okay. This is the 4th Ray Do It Hydrating Hyaluronic Acid Mist. Again, this is goes with the other one. Good for blue light. And then we got the Waterfall Gentle Tonic Toner. So it's a toner. This is a mist. This would go with the Another setting spray, the Dew Set from Anastasia. I have a lot of setting sprays, guys, more than I should. We have the Elf Plus Glow Dewy Mist with coconut and argan oil. And then this is the Morph Morphe Madison Beer Seal the Deal Luminous Setting Spray. Luminous, but I don't see. Okay, anyways. Here we go. We have the Ordinary AHA 30% BHA 2% Pilling Solution. The red one, guys, be careful if you use this, for God's sake, please. Be careful. Look it up. Look up other people's stories. Just be careful. It is good if you do it the right way. And thank you again. You know who you are for getting this. You guys know who she is. We have, like I said, I like the sprays. This is the Hyaluronic Hydrating Essence Spray from Revolution. This is the Revolution Rose and Chamomile Calming and Soothing Serum. We got a Revolution Quinoa Night Pill Serum. We have another ordinary product. This is the Retinol 0.5% and Squalane Highly Stable Water-Free Solution of 0.5 Pure Retinol. Retinol and Hyaluronic Acid are very good for the skin. 
This is another ordinary hyaluronic acid, 2% plus B5. And then we have another Revolution EGF Serum, Skin Conditioning Serum. Those are all serums. Close that, okay. We're almost done taking everything out. This is a Eloise Get Gleaming Body Glow Illuminator. Okay. Hmm. Then we have an e.l.f. All the Feels Facial Oil. I don't have many facial oils, but I do keep a couple. Then we have the Hibisca Unspottable Correcting Oil from Volition. We have the Soul Shimmering Dry Oil. You see it? Now watch. How beautiful. Oops. Do you see that? Then we have this gorgeous one from Anastasia, her shimmer body oil. You ready for this? It's just like, it's like the others, like, oops, dang it. See the soul one? How the, how it moves around in the bottle? This one does it. It's just a more denser version. Okay, now... We have Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Niacinamide Dew Drops, which are about right there. I can see it through the bottle because I did use these. We have the Trilogy Everything Balm, the Hello Kitty and Color Pop. This is the Pineapple Scrub. Then this is my new Vanilla Lip Sleeping Mask that I just got from Revolution. Oh, I didn't know I had this. A fourth ray aha moment exfoliating enzyme mask for your lips. And then last, we have the Velour Lip Scrub in Witch's Brew, which whatever flavor you thought it was when you smelled it. Those are the lip products. I did not spill any apple juice on this one. So this one's just going to be a quick wipe down. And then I'm going to spray it with my spray yeah I could see the dust I doubt if I showed it to you that you guys would be able to because it's clear but just trust me it was there okay now we have a lot of toners so let's see um maybe both of the bottom drawers will be toners Bigger ones over there. No point in stuffing it. We have more to go, so we'll put the other ones over here. You are not a toner. And you. And you. There we go. Okay. And then. Let's see. Body oil. Will you fit here? Of course you are not. Will you fit down there? No. Okay, so we're going to put our body oils right here. And I'm going to put the hair serum with them. Then, did we have any eye creams over here? No. So we're going to put all of our eye serums. Wait, wait is this our shortest one? Yes, wait. Yeah, since I have my toners and things over here, I'm going to keep my eye creams over here as well. There we go. Dew drops. Is there anywhere over here they should be? I would say they. I would put these with a primer. But, no. But, I, no. I'm just going to keep them down there for now. Now... Actually, 
I have a lot of setting sprays, so I need this spot for setting sprays. Let's see. So we'll put that in with that. And we'll just get this extra toner up top for now because it's the only one that it has. Now, let me move all this over. All these dang setting sprays. This mist. This is the only one, so go ahead and throw it up there for now. You need to come down here. Spray, 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 spray. Let's see, okay. It's a serum. That is not going to be with the serums because that can hurt you if you don't know what you're doing. That is a peel, so that'll go with that. That's a serum. Okay. So let's put the serums with the serums. Not damn they all fit. Woo! Okay. Please fit. Of course you won't. So we're going to put our two sprays up here with our other spray. Now, I'm going to put these two peels over here by themselves so that I know that's what they are. Now, time to do the setting sprays. So, we got this big spot and this one. But can we fit them all? That is the question. I don't think so. But we'll see. Eye makeup removers. You. 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 No. You. you. Yes. Maybe. No. Yes. Maybe. Okay. Well, let me put you up there because you're taking up a lot of room you don't need to take up. Maybe I should put all the setting sprays up top, on the top. Let's try that. It smells good in here since I sprayed that perfume that I wasn't sure what it smelled like. Okay, there's that. Now this side. This damn square one from e.l.f. will really be messing things up. Put that one in the middle. And you try and keep the names front and center. Pretty fresh hyaluronic one from ColourPop. Love it. Don't do this to me. We'll put this, those on the other side. Got that one toner right there. These are the makeup cleaners by themselves because, okay, good, good, good exfoliator along with the two things that are for exfoliating works perfect. Oh, we get this little one. That's okay. Perfect! I love when things all go into place. Wait a minute. Let me try a little fit here. No? Okay. Back to there. All right. Now we got the eye makeup removers right there. All of our sprays there. Okay, let me give you an overview. Here we go. These are all moisturizers. These are all moisturizers, face milks. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I knew I had another toner. 
Hold on a minute. Sorry, I just get excited when things fit into place. Okay, so we have our Garnier, another Garnier, another Garnier. We have moisturizers. Down here, all serums, which actually, you don't, I'll cut this out. I need them to all be front facing so that I know what I'm grabbing. Then we have all primers. Our special moisturizer. These are an all elf products, by the way. And then we have this free spot. Up here, we have our two eye makeup removers. This is also micellar water, but that's always there. Then we have our three sprays, pretty much essence sprays. Okay, so that's that one. Now, this one. We have two toners. These are all oils, body oils and shimmers. Dang it. These are all toners, just like the other one, but since they wouldn't all fit together, I put toners on one side and then directly on the other side. These are all eye creams. These are all makeup brush cleaners. And these are all exfoliators or peels of some kind, minus the glow drops, which they probably shouldn't be in there. We'll just put them with the toners for now. And then up here is all setting sprays, which need to be turned around. And we have these setting sprays. These setting sprays. And that one. So that is everything. Oh, I missed this eye cream. There we go. So that is everything for this at least. So now it's time to put all that stuff, which there's going to be some for here. There's going to be some makeup, but let's get into it. This video's already been so damn long. Actually, this video will be the first part, which was cleaning out and organizing that. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and the second part will be putting everything away. So I'm sorry that I misled you, but if you did enjoy, then please consider subscribing below. Leave me a comment, hit that like button if you enjoyed, and hit the bell so you know when the next part comes. See you later, lovelies. Bye.